Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to another Marvel Snap video. In this video, we're going to be having a look at uh, six decks for Eliath. I made one extra by mistake instead of the normal five, but anyways. We're looking at Eliath, the brand new card. He's a 6-5, unrevealed, destroy all enemy cards played here this turn, including unrevealed card. So, pretty much means he's a perfect Galactus card. You can't lose if you play Galactus and you have Eliath and you have an issue. You cannot lose, which you're probably going to have an issue if you're playing Galactus. So you can't lose with this card, which is amazing. Uh, so we're going to have a look at a couple of decks. This week's a great week to open your spotlight caches. Following the snow card buff, she's really good right now. She's like a cheap legion. And Hitmonk is good as well. So very good week. Probably one of the better weeks. So if you need these cards, you need Hitmonkey, you want... Eliath, maybe you don't care about Snow Guard. It's still a good week to open them. Let's get into the decks. So the first deck is a Thanos list. You're just going to stick them in a Thanos control list, right? Just might not be great, but like you get Professor Vex down early, right? So you've got a chance to uh, Eliath a lane and just win it. So the idea is you're going to lock a lane down with a Psylocke or a stone into Professor X on four, probably. And then you've got a life to go in a lane and just win it for you. Should work, hopefully. Okay, next deck is a Silky Smooth Alive deck. Uh, this is one I'm not sure about, but I think there's going to be something here where you're going to put a life in a like a, a mid rangey deck, possibly, where you can do this because this deck puts out a lot of tempo early, right? So you've got your early, you've got your Angela, your Cravens, you're bouncing Kitty around. It's got Wave, which makes Kitty a little problem. So you're not really relying on your Kitty. Your Kitty's more for moving your Silk and your Angela around. you got to get value out of it. And then you Wave on 5, and then Alive. Or you can Arrow or Doom. It gives you extra options. It gives you a lot of options. Next up is standard Destroy type stuff. We're going to just destroy a lot of stuff. It's got magic in here, so we can get a turn seven out of here. So you could like a liar for lane and then null it if you wanted to. You've got X23 in, so if you destroy X23 on turn four, a liar from five, uh, null on six, no, no, Zola on six, and then into null could be fantastic. You'd have, you'd have so much pressure on the board. Destroy keeps getting cards, keeps getting options. It's terrifying how strong. Destroy could be. This one's a bit of a, a G Man destroy. So we're going to have a Nebula for some tempo, Forge to buff up like Wolverine or Nimrod, or you could even buff up your Goblins or Galactus. Pretty good options. You've got Electron Wave to ramp out Galactus, get him out early, get a tempo, get a life down, guarantee the win. Death, because there's a lot of early game stuff right now. Like there's a lot of uh, trying to flood the board with Loki stuff, right? He's trying to get early cards out there, generating more cards. So you can destroy it. Maybe you get you play a couple of cards, they play a couple, you get cheap death, your life death, bam, easy clap. Or if you get Electro down early, you could maybe death a turn earlier. You could death on five, so you have initiative on six, and then you can't lose it with life. Unless say like armor or something like that, but yeah. Uh, next up's a bit of a Zabu type uh, Dark Oak uh, statue type thing. The idea is the main idea I wanted a lot of stats with a G great into wave so that you can lock them into getting easily destroyed in the Gene Grey lane. So that was the idea that we plan to get a lot of tempo down early and then wave and a life into the Gene Grey lane. Might work, might not. There's something there. Could be fun. And then lastly is a ramp deck. We're going straight up ramp, you know, your ramp, Sandman. Uh, so Electro into Sandman. Then you can go like Black Panther, Zola, or Eliab, of Zola, stuff like that. Or you've got Odin, stuff. There's plenty of options. Could be fun. Uh, it might work, might not work. Anyways, that's it for this video. Uh, I should have a, hopefully have a depth video out in a couple of hours. Once I get up and play the card. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.